drama as community and family members allegedly battle over Junior Pope's body, community insists he must be buried in the river. A disagreement has arisen regarding funeral arrangements for Nollywood actor Pope Odon Wodo, popularly known as Junior Pope, following his recent passing. Reports indicate a disagreement between Junior Pope's family and the members of the community where he died. The community reportedly adheres to a traditional belief that individuals who perish in rivers should be buried beside them. However, the actor's family has reportedly chosen to not follow this tradition. The community pointed out that there will be heavy spiritual consequences if he is not buried beside the river. News outlets indicate they requested the body from a medical professional who secured it in a private room. As it quotes, Concerning Junior Pope's death, there are three updates. 1. Some people in the community are insisting that they must bury him in the river because they believe it is necessary for his children and the community's well-being, unless there will be serious spiritual consequences and heavy repercussions. 2. His family does not agree and will not give up his body. The community went to the hospital to get his body, but the doctor in charge refused and locked his body in a private room and locked the door. Some other group of people are saying the family should take the body to a specific shrine before 2 a.m. where a certain herbalist will charge where a certain herbalist in charge of the river will supposedly bring him back to life. Emeka Rollers and some Nollywood actors are there currently pushing for the body to be taken to the shrine. Well, what are your opinions on this? Make sure to leave them in the comments down below and don't forget to like and subscribe and make sure to turn on notifications so you can be notified when we upload daily content here on this channel and don't forget to share this video with your family and friends so that they know what is going on and they can give their own opinions on this. Now let's see what other people have to say about this. The community does not have to drag it. I always tell people, do not fight for any god. Allow the spirit to do what they know how to do. If one goes against that tradition, if the spirit is not strong, then so be it. Humans do not fight for any spirit. This is useless traditional beliefs. What nonsense is that? Family should police and take the body to his hometown, Africa and backwardness. I pray as a CEO of Biz of a biz or any company that calamity should not be for you if it does you will then understand what adan maluk is passing through now may your enemies not remember you or your peak of your glory wicked people can go to any length to bring somebody down they do not care about the consequences if you do not know something ask questions most of us ignorance of our tradition is killing people slowly. Anybody that died in the river must be buried beside the river. That is the law. If the water spirits and if you must be in and if you must bury the person outside the river, then be ready to perform some rituals. If you refuse to perform the rituals and take the corpse for burial outside the river, then your family should be ready for the consequences. Give to Caesar what belongs to Caesar. Over spiritually, now you won't kill us for this Niger. So because he died in the river, he now belongs to the river. If the people agree, they caused it. Adan Maluk, or what so called herself or himself, the priest in charge of the river should stop wasting that time. Lone in his own town. To hell with those who believe in Adan Maluka. Those who those who took Junior Pope to the Adan to, to the Adan Maluka should be arrested as well because they have hands in his death. Had they been there, they took him straight to the hospital after the mortician told them this one still has life in him. Junior Pope would have survived now. This is the truth. If the marine spirit needs someone, the person will never be seen after drowning.
all these ones that are saying we person drown them, they must bury them near the river is evil traditions and the repercussions for not doing so are caused by evil people who go diabolically against those that refuse. And when the person is more powerful, the diabolical man starts diabolical attacks on the community who will now use physical force to get the corpse if it is army general that drowned. Who is going to talk? Why are you using these incidents to attack Adam Maluka? The cause of his death was actually the river, so the community where he died are right to demand he is buried there. It is so everywhere where there is a drowning. But I must plead that the producer Adanma should not be accused of his death, because Nigeria is not a country where rules are obeyed. Well, these people have all given their opinions on this. Make sure to leave your own opinions in the comments down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And make sure to turn on notifications so you can be notified when we upload daily content here on this channel. And don't forget to share this video with your family and friends so that they know what 